Hello. <laughs> I'm about to get dressed. To go get some groceries for the week. Today is Sunday. And the decision I had set for today was to just rest and cook me something good to fucking eat. Because my body, I'm so thankful for my body right now. Like, my body has been showing up for me. I was at the post studio yesterday. And I just felt so, no, not yesterday, day before. No, it was yesterday. Damn, the days is just mushing together. But yesterday I was at the post studio. I had a private class and then I had an extra hour in there by myself. And I just felt so free and so like in tune with my body. My body really showed up for me. I explored some new movements and I'm just really proud. So I was like, today, bitch, today, you shall reciprocate, okay? With a good home-cooked meal by the chef herself I am. I'm gonna put on some little leggings, make it look like I worked that today or something. Ooh, I got a legging sponsorship. My first sponsorship for this channel. I'm so excited. So excited, actually. Am I gonna show y'all right now? Hold on, let me take this off. I'm gonna show y'all right now. Go ahead and keep on moving this video. So first of all, let's just get into the packaging. The fact that it's like a cute little purse. Like, I just wanna be like, yes, yeah, sister. Look at my new leggings. But this brand is called Fanka. And they sent me some leggings. Apparently they're pantyless. Um, and they look like they fit really nice. I got two pairs. I know I chose a black pair. The packaging is just so cute. It says that they're bump fitting, tummy control, double sided wear, bitch, not they reversal, and high compression. So it's like a lift and curve kind of effect. I love how they feel like they feel yes they got this little detailing let's get out the bathroom let's go to the window so y'all can really get into them but yeah y'all i'm so excited to have my first sponsorship on this channel thank you thank you okay so they feel like really like thick and supported with the band, like very tight, but still stretchy. So definitely will give that stomach control. Let's put them on. Okay, hold up, let me get a shirt. Okay, so this is the shirt. They fit real good. Ah, they're really comfortable. The back has like these grid type of thing. I don't know if y'all can see, y'all can see. So they're really form-fitting, like, I love it. Okay, I'm definitely about to leave these on. And I'm about to do a little yoga before I go. See, I can't remember if I chose, I think I chose olive for my second color. Oh no, baby, I chose tan. Oh no, they're gray. <gasps> Not I don't know my colors. This pair feels a lot softer. I think this is a different kind. Okay, yeah, so this, the features of this one is with the built-in underwear. They're soft and lightweight and a four-way stretch. These definitely feel so soft. Okay, so I'm gonna show y'all the underwear fit. It's literally like just lined. I don't know if I told y'all already, but I got a size small of these for so good. I ain't gonna lie. This pair, bitch, is giving me exactly what I need for the heel. Don't play. 
play with me. Let me give y'all a little runway show. Mm. Cause y'all already know, baby, we stretch. Don't fucking play with me. Don't play with me and my new leggings. Just don't do it. Y'all like these. I really wish that y'all could feel them. Cause they just feel so good. Like, yes ma'am. Honestly, I can't really say that I've been showing up on the mat every day or as much as I would like. Like I really only do yoga for real. Since I was sick, I think I did yoga like once or twice. I don't know, I tried to do it one day. I didn't have the energy. So ever since being sick, I just haven't been showing up on the mat as much as I would like. Besides when I have a cold class. To Tim, for you and your friends, you know how I spend in Nature, you S T O N. I get too crazy, had a little bad enough. We stay good friends, we get too crazy. All I know is that when this cup ends, the next one begins. My babe, you know me, and you knew me back then. And you know how it goes when I see you again. You know I'm making my Way to your hands, and you know I need you to be there for me. You a little post so baby. You a little 48 baby. Got a little candy in a pocket. She gon' take off like a You already know. Dirty up a couple on the north side. Text you, but I know you probably caught side. No, I gotta come and check the whole man, baby. Hold tight. I just touched the city with the cheap block stainers. And we got adopted by some fit for strangers. You know what it means when I twist these fingers. Me and you being on a first name basis. Why you think I hate it when you talk that Drake shit? Same reason that you never left me hanging. Same reason that I tried to make you famous. Same reason that I tried to show you just who I was. Outside of the club. Outside of things that I Why I wanna know How many drinks would it take to 
plants bitch look at how fucking withered and skimpy stardom got i couldn't even finish my motherfucking straight i paid 70 dollars for them plants for me to do my very best well i'm gonna say very best because i didn't get a chance to try the little rock magic because the niggas died before i could i still have not got used to like having to walk up the stairs and down the elevator and escalators and shit to go grocery shopping like <laughs> Atlanta it's like it's all extravagant Like, I was just feeling a little anxious. So I literally grabbed bread, some pasta noodles, and chips. Because, <laughs> bitch, I had to get the fuck. And they really was scamped in there. Like, they didn't have a lot in stock. So I'm about to just go to Publix. I don't know. I be feeling more in flow at Publix because that's where I shopped at in Savannah. But when I was in Rome, I had to go to Kroger. And I just don't really like shopping in Kroger. All of these stores are right beside each other. Like, I do not be having to go too far at all. And I love that. People stay flicking up over here. <laughs> I swear to God, every time I'm at Kroger, I see somebody taking pictures at Kroger. They love it. 
I am so fucking happy. Ah, it's a great day. It's a great fucking day. I'm just here to say that I make the best pasta. Homemade Alfredo, what about it? Before quarantine, y'all, I couldn't cook shit. Like, Jordan and his mama had to teach me how to cook. Now I am a cooking ass bitch. My, please don't play with me. Thought you was trying to play. <laughs>